All right, everybody, the big game is coming up. And joining us is Megan with Rico's. She's going to tell us how we can make these recipes tasty, cheesy. You can find them on Rico's website. So right now we have the spicy sausage cheese, correct? Yes. So it's very simple. It's just three ingredients. You're going to use cooked, one pound of cooked sausage, one cup of a salsa of your choice, and two cans of our condensed cheddar cheese sauce. Okay. And what so. you do is you'll just mix it. Do you want me to pour one of these out for you? Yes, please. Alrighty. We'll do two cans. Two cans. Condensed nacho cheese. Yeah, that should be good. That's good. Okay. So once you get all the ingredients in there, okay. you will just mix it together. So for the big game, this could be a really good recipe because, I mean, it doesn't take that much work. Tell us a little bit about, you know, why no. this is an easy on the go. It's kind. very simple. It's only three ingredients. And once you've mixed it all together, you just throw it in the crock pot and turn it on, and you can go do whatever you need to do. But it's one of those dishes that seems to please all different types of taste buds. So it'll be a hit at your get-together. Could you mix it up with even ground beef and ground you could. turkey? Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. You could tweak it to however you would like to do it. Um, you could add peppers and make it a little spicier. Um, totally your choice. And how cool is this? You guys are the originators of the ballpark nachos, and this we is kind are. of like a little twist on that. It is. It's a different type of way of eating nachos. Um, obviously, our favorite is the original, where you just put the cheese sauce over the chip. But this gives other options for our different kinds of cheese sauces. Okay, so now once you have that all mixed up, what do we do? You put it in the crock pot, okay. turn it on high, and you just let it cook all day long. Wow, that looks so good. Is there a time limit for how long they should have it on the crock, in the crock pot? Usually it's about 30 minutes. You put it on high, and then once it starts to look creamy like this, you can just turn it down to warm and let it sit all day long. All right, girl. Well, you know I've got to taste <laughs> the spicy so. sausage cheesy dip. Oh, my goodness. I'm excited. It's going to be messy. All right. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Too good to talk. So, where can people find this recipe? It's on our website, under the recipe section. I think it's under the appetizers category. Um, but, I mean, you can search through all of them. There's so many different recipes there. You can try this one. You can try others. Um, perfect for the big game get-togethers. And there's no excuse to say you can't find the cheese anywhere. You guys are no. all around the world. We are in over 57 countries. But this cheese sauce, you can find at your local grocery store. Very easy to find. So, no excuses. H-E-B. H-E-B, Walmart. Awesomeness. All right, Megan, well, thank you so much for this cheesy deliciousness here. Um, but we also have a, something for the viewers, a little bit we of a do. giveaway. We do. We're going to be giving away a gift basket. Um, it's full of a lot of our Rico's and Texan Original items. It'll be great for you to win prior to your big game party. So all you have to do is be the fifth caller. Call 946-GDSA, and you'll get that. Rico's basket of cheesy goodness. Thank you yes. so much. Thank you.